just gonna pretend like I know how to do this. <laughs> uh, okay. Today's St. Patrick's Day. I was very inspired by multiple things. First of all, the fact that it's St. Patrick's Day, green, right? Um, the fact that I'm quarantined and going crazy, can you tell? Um, but germs are green, usually, right? Also, I just quit my job, and I've been thinking about that all day. I worked at a bank, money, green, get it? Okay, um, I used... <laughs> And they all click off of my video. <laughs> um, I was super inspired actually by this new palette uh, by Morphe. I actually, I don't know if it's new. It's new to me. Um, it's called Make and Bank, which is ironic for a couple different reasons. Um, this shade in the corner here is what I have all over uh, my inner corner. And it's like duochrome. Oh, I'm looking at them view for anything behind me it's so freaking pretty so if you want to know how to get this greeny germy money makeup look then just keep watching what is that song it's a nice car alarm that's a crazy sounding car alarm <laughs> okay, so that was a fire alarm, and we've been outside for how long? 30 minutes. <laughs> 30 minutes. So I guess, I don't really know what happened if one fire alarm went off, and then we live in an apartment complex, so if they all just go off when one goes off, I really don't know. But when I tell you... This man ran back in the house and said, it's the fire alarm. I grabbed all of our medication <laughs> and every laptop in the house. <laughs> and we sat in the truck for 30 minutes waiting for a billion firefighters to come out of our building and tell us that everything was burnt to the ground. <laughs> so much for quarantine, forcing us out of the house. Lord have mercy. Okay. I look like a freaking crazy person standing out there too, like as if it matters, but whatever. <laughs> okay, so now that the house isn't burnt to the ground, we're gonna put on some eye makeup. I'm gonna use this new palette from Morphe. I actually don't know if it's new, but it's new to me. Um, I went down there and got it in the store. The guy at the Morphe store in Tampa, I don't remember what his name is. Plus, what was his name? I don't know. He was blonde. He has the cutest little tattoo on his hand. He was so freaking nice. The entire time, he would like come over and talk to me and then leave and then come back over and talk to me. And I felt like a total mess. I went in there, no makeup, sweatpants, looking like a crazy homeless woman and dropped hundreds of dollars on makeup. And I'm sure he was like, what the heck are you doing here? But whatever. Um... So I got this, he talked me into getting this. <laughs> Look how beautiful it is. It is so cute. And all of, I think I have the names here somewhere. All of the names are so funny, like um, deposits, check please, cash or card. <laughs> this one's called Dalla Dalla. I love it, it's so cute. It's actually called Make and Bank, 18B. <laughs> 18, could it be for bank? And in light of recent events, I feel like it's appropriate. Uh, I'm gonna use my P. Louise base in the color 0.5 and a concealer brush. I don't know. Okay, so there's an eyeshadow in here. I don't know if you can see. I have a really weird setup right now. So this one in the corner here, I can kind of see. It looks goldy, but in certain lights, it looks like green. I don't know if 
you can tell. It's kind of got a duochrome effect. I want to use it, but also I'm scared. I think, ooh, maybe I'll use that as my inner corner. So I'm going to use the Morphe Jaclyn Hill JH33. It's good for like um, crease work. I am going to use um, the shade Check Please. I am basically using the shadow to carve out the shape of my eye, like right in the hollow here. So there's still tackiness on the lower half of my lid and I am going to take the yellow shade in this palette and it is called Jackpot. It's right here, this yellowy shade. I'm pretty sure this is the, the um, stock brush that comes in Anastasia palettes. I'm pretty sure. It's kind of got a, literally any fluffy um, blending brush will work. And I'm just taking it right into this. If you can see, hopefully I went into the right one. Jeez Louise. I'm not made for YouTube life. This might be a good St. Patty's Day look if we were going somewhere. Yep, if we weren't confined and we're getting expelled from our house because somebody lit it on fire. Their toaster on too long. <laughs> Day three of quarantine and they light their house on fire. <laughs> oh no. Actually going to use the other side of this brush it's kind of I call these like hamster tail brushes it's very teeny but packed in there there's a lot of bristles in there and I'm gonna take the shade stacks um, it's this muted green shade um, and I am just going to move this back and forth in the brush to kind of pack it into the bristles there's a lot of fallout. I'm scared this is gonna be all over my cheeks. And then tap off the excess. <gasps> Holy cow, can you see that? I'm going to take this on the outer third of my eye and just press it so that we don't have tons of fallout on the cheeks. We're gonna go back and blend this later. Don't worry if you look like a crazy lady. <laughs> My dog shuts herself in the bathroom door. I swear she does it to irritate me. She goes in there, puts her nose up, and shuts the door. <laughs> she's had enough. She's had enough. I stopped petting her, and so she's like, hmm, I'm going to the other room now. I'm going to take that same brush we used for the transition shade, um, the JH33, and I am going to... I'm going to go into that green shade, and then go in right into the corner where we were just trying to blend. I am just kind of diffusing this color over the lid. I'm trying to go in an upward motion to keep the eyes lifted instead of going down. Okay, so I'm gonna take the M124 brush um, and I'm gonna take a little bit more of that P. Louise face um, on the back of my hand just a little, like the thinnest possible bit on the back of this brush. And I'm gonna clean up the edge of this eyeshadow. Just gonna blend that in as best I can with this little sponge. I'm gonna go back in with the the um, the yellow. 
and a different brush because I dirtied the other one. Here's a smaller, um, I'm not sure what number this is. It's rubbed off. I know it's Morphe. It's a tiny little blending brush. And I'm going to go back in with the yellow and just blend the inner corner. Probably the top half. I'm leaving this little section right here um, blank. And I think I'm going to put the duochrome shade there, but I'm not quite sure. I've been wanting to start this channel for literally since as long as I've known you. Well, yeah, since like I was 14 when I very first started watching Jaclyn Hill's videos. Okay, so now that they're blended how I like, I'll throw the brush on the ground. That same brush I used for the P. Louise base to clean up the edges. It's a tiny little circle brush. I'm gonna take that duochrome shade down here. I swear, it's, it looks like three different colors. It's like greeny and gold and also kind of reddish in certain lights, like ready. So I'm just gonna pack this brush full. Kinda dust off a little bit of the excess. I'm gonna spray it with a little bit of the Morphe Fix Plus. Just kidding, the Morphe Continuous Setting Mist. <laughs> so above, you see where my eye, like um, the fold of it right here, I'm gonna kinda go above this line to create the illusion of more lid space. How pretty. I might actually go in with a little bit on my finger and just press it down. I'm, I'm going to put it a little bit on my inner corner. I'm going to end this video and it's going to be literally all over my face because I just like it is so pretty. Holy wow. I love this. Okay. I'm going to do the other eye. I just finished the other eye. I'm obsessed with this eyeshadow. I looked over at Jay and he goes, oh. <laughs> so now I'm gonna take that bigger brush, no extra product on it at all, and just run that underneath my eye. I'm then going to take that brush, that same um, tiny blending brush, that we use for the yellow. And I'm gonna dip it right back into the yellow and go along the underneath of my eye right here. So now that we look like we have jaundice, <laughs> we are going to first of all go back in with that um, that duochrome shade. Um, guess what the name of it is? Because I have neglected to tell you thus far. Bazillionaire. <laughs> Which I think is perfect. Okay, so now that I've got the shadow how I want it, I am going to do my brows and maybe a little eyeliner definitely lashes then I'll be right back um what's next I think I'm gonna go in with more bronzer I'm gonna use a different one this time though this is the frenemy brontour by morphe um it's kind of got a lighter highlighty shade it's a little it's a little shimmery not much um but I really like this darker one um, I'm going to use a big fluffy brush. This is the Morphe R7. And I'm just going to swirl it around in here. And then just brush it mostly on the apples of the cheek and back. Same thing with the forehead. Kind of into my hairline. I just kind of want to warm up the skin. I'm gonna use 
this NYX um, bronzer. This is not a bronzer. Baked Blush Illuminator and Bronzer. Um, it's in the shade Wanderlust. And it's kind of a corally, pinky, orangey type of color. All the E's. And just apply it to the apple. You can always um, smile and they kind of pop out just on the apple of your cheek. Now I'm going to use the Jaclyn um, Flash Highlighter Palette. Um, I love the shade, what's it called? The shade Iced up in this top corner here. I am just going to sweep this right on the tops of the cheekbones. Like the bridge right here and then the tip of the nose. My Cupid's bow. All of the places the sun would directly hit. Okay, I have the <clears throat> ColourPop Lippy Pencil in the shade BFF. It's a very like neutral lip liner. I'm gonna use the Morphe Liquid Lip in the shade Taunt. It's kind of an orangey neutral shade. I'm hoping that this color will kind of bring out the reddish undertones of the um, bazillionaire shade in the inner corner. We shall see. Woo. Okay, we're done, babes. Look. Today's St. Patrick's Day, right now. I know it's not for you because this is gonna take me forever to edit this video. I don't know what I'm doing. Blah. Blah, 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 bl